Hello Capricorn, how are you? Welcome to my channel, Star Star Star. So Capricorn, this is your reading for the month of December. This is your reading for the last week of December. Okay. And this is a general reading. So take what resonates and leave what doesn't. And energies might be vice versa. Okay, Capricorn. Also, uh, if you find this reading resonating... Uh, if you're getting uh, if you're getting resonated with this reading, I would appreciate if you like, share, and subscribe, and comment down below. Okay, all right, Capricorn. So what is going on with you for the last week of December, Capricorn? What is going on with you for the last week of December, Capricorn? What is going on with you for the last week of December, Spirits? Tell me what is going on with Capricorn for the last week of December. What is going on with Capricorn for the last week of December? Spirits, tell me. <clears throat> Whoa. At the bottom of the deck, we have lovers. Then the first card is nine of cups. The page of swords. Page of cups. Okay. Queen of Pentacles, Four of Wands, the Hierophant, interesting, and the bottom of the deck we have Lovers. So Capricorn, you may be dealing with a Gemini, with a Taurus more particularly. Otherwise, I see all the signs over here. Uh, Pisces, Cancer, Scorpio, Gemini, Libra, Aquarius, Aries, Leo, Sag, and Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn. Okay, but more particularly, a uh, Gemini and a Taurus. Uh, so, yes, there's a lot of love that is present between both of you. Uh, you people may be a soul, you know, past life soulmates. You people may be twin flames, most likely past life soulmates. That's what I'm hearing. Uh, I see that Capricorn, subconsciously you're manifesting your person back. You are manifesting your person back because there is a lot of love. Uh, not just you, even your person is mirroring you. Even this person is manifesting you and you are manifesting your person. Uh, probably this person was someone who was not doing good financially beforehand uh, when you people were together and they needed some time and a part or you know they were quite busy in their work and they were uh, busy in their work so that they could accu accumulate some sort of wealth okay uh, they could be uh, sure about their financial position and this person probably was a very workaholic or is a very workaholic person they are all about work and of course you felt uh, neglected you felt that this person uh, couldn't give you what uh, you deserve and you were not able to understand why because you had a very strong connection with this person and you know that this person loves you okay you know that okay uh you know your intuition <coughs> sorry <clears throat> your intuition speaks loudly to you your intuition is like literally shouting from the rooftop that this person loves you and you knew that from the start and that's why you started getting attracted towards this person so strongly okay the moment you saw this person you saw love in their eyes okay uh, this person was so all over you initially uh, and you immediately recognize that this person loves you and you also of course you had attraction towards them but you gradually fell uh, you know uh, fell in love with them and uh, later on going by their behavior this person was ignoring you or purposefully this person was pushing you away your their actions and their behavior was confusing you their, their behavior was you know uh, you you started becoming very sad you started becoming very sad that why they are behaving like this why they are pushing me away this person was focusing on accumulating their wealth this person needed some time away and apart uh, so that they will they will make their financial position strong they will make their uh, you know 
uh, their wealth and everything so you know so that they can come prepared towards you don't uh, don't at all think that this person is not thinking about you or not keeping about uh, you know not keeping watch on you or they don't know about your whereabouts this person knows every single thing about you okay even if you people have been separated whatever time has been you know it's been you people are uh, staying away and apart from each other whatever the time may be time period may be maybe a couple of months maybe years this person is keeping a watch on you okay they are keeping a watch on you because they want you back okay they are manifesting you back but just they are waiting for the right time and even you are waiting for the right time probably you know deep down that this is the one for you why i'm talking so that this is a one because look the kind of cards we have i'm not joking okay we have lovers card we have four of wands which represents commitment and uh, you know marriage we have hierophant which again represents commitment and marriage okay so all the cards are like shouting uh commitment and marriage you know this reading is all about commitment and marriage just that uh this will happen at the right time okay uh, this will happen at the right time and you you were both of you were meant to go through this period of separation this connection is fated the separation was fated so even if you could have made any kind of efforts to you know um make amends yeah uh, still you had to go through this or uh, separation so that you know it's so whatever happened it was fated that's the bottom line all right so what is going on with you capricorn 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 spirits tell me what is going on with capricorn tell me what is going on with capricorn spirits tell me what is going on with capricorn the first card we have is five of cups they are not happy without you okay ace of cups whoa knight of cups ace of wands we have two aces are you kidding me we have nine of wands and two of swords okay bottom of the deck queen of pentacles okay so yes this person is going to come back and make an offer with that knight of cups okay this person will start uh, you know i i heard valentine okay valentine's day this person is going to come towards you on valentine that's what i heard this person will bring a bouquet of roses and they will be like you know they will approach you or probably they will be just like hi how are you how are you doing you know maybe they will start uh, with a f uh, with a friendship initially but they will come on valentines okay they are going to come towards you on valentines this person will uh, you know this person it, once they understand that you are comfortable with them you are comfortable talking with them and you are not angry with them anymore then they will this person will propose about rekindling uh the relationship between both of you they want to have of course they are, they are going to come towards you with romantic intentions okay they want to rekindle this romance all over again they are not happy without you you are not happy without them both of you want each other both of you want to start this love affair all over again both of you want uh to have this uh, you know passionate start both of you probably were very much intimate with each other there was a very strong uh, bond but a very strong sexual intimacy as well when you people were together uh, so both of you are craving that okay you people are manifesting each other subconsciously this with the two of swords i see that uh, when this person is going to come back uh you you are like you know you will entertain them you are going to hear them out but you are not going to agree to them right away you are not going to agree to them right away that's what i'm hearing okay uh you you will you will ask them to prove themselves you're like i don't trust you now 
okay i there was a trust beforehand but you broke that trust you were not what i expected or what i wanted and this relationship was not going in the direction the way i wanted it to go and you are responsible for that now you are responsible to rebuild that trust in this relationship all over again okay and then only you can have me you are going to set your conditions okay you are going to lay down the rules this time okay you are going to lay down the rules and once this person is successful in earning your trust then you will like you know you both will be intimate once again all right capricorn i hope this resonates please hit like share and subscribe and comment down below till then bye